Okay, it's Sunday. What? Well, it's uh, October 12th, I believe. On Sunday, October 12th, and I'm inside of my car right now. And today, I had a nice big bowl of soup. And uh, I'm here at Rite Aid, which is behind the car there. And I'm already here. I just took my son to the mall, Port Hills Mall. And uh, with his friends, with his friend right now, I drop him off at In and Out. But in any case, so today I did not walk. You know, did I prepare the soup? I had a lot of things to load up uh, to YouTube. Some, pro some um, files I did for my church were not going through, so I had to do it three times. Or, or in any case, but. So today I did not walk, and uh, the 84th day it's supposed to be. It was like Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So, so if today is the 12th, so it's day 84. Yeah, okay. Uh, Wednesday was 80. Yeah, so today, today is day 84. Four days after the 80 day, the still water fast. So I can say Sunday evening is right now like 8.47, I mean 7.47. It's kind of early, but it's dark at night. So I'm inside my car, I put all the lights. I don't know if you'll be able to see me. Uh, but that's where I'm at right now. I'm inside the car. And uh, I expect to have gained a couple of pounds today. I ate pretty good. I enjoy that chicken almond soup. And so I had that today, and I also prepared a grape lemonade, a lemonade that I made out of grapes and key limes, and uh, I had a couple of glasses of that. You know, I hadn't had it, hadn't had, hadn't had that for about almost a uh, half a year, I think. So I had some of that. So I made a nice hefty bowl of uh, chicken almond soup, like I said. And um, so right now I'm going to go inside there. And there's a lady inside there waiting for me. Uh, I ordered her the book, The Grape Cure, which is one of the reasons, Grape Cure by Johanna Brandt. It's a good book I recommend for anybody that wants to get into real serious fasting or the one to even get healed from cancer. That The Grape Cure is a good cure for cancer, but it also helps to lose weight and get rid of all kinds of stuff. So I've been telling this lady that she's seen me come in and out and she's seen the progress She's usually reading there, so I thought I'd get her the book. So I just got the book right now, and I'm about to walk in there and give it to her. You know, hopefully, she'll learn something from that and benefit to herself too. She said, "Been trying to lose weight for it. You know, she's not that big, but she said she understands she could lose some weight and she'd be wanting to try something that will work. So hopefully, you know, she reads it, follows the instructions. I might be able to, it might be able to help her. So." That's what's going on right now. So, but that's the situation right now. So, in a minute, I'm, I'm walking down there. I'm getting up my car right now. I'm gonna walk over there. So, see you guys in a minute. Welcome to the Higgy Station. Click next to get going. Are you a guy or a gal? How tall are you? When were you born? So, does this sound like you? Let's check your blood pressure and pulse. Place your left arm in the cup. Turn your palm to the sky. Relax and breathe normally. Watch out. Press begin to get started. Forget to take my wristwatch off. Uh, here we go. If you'd like to cancel this test at any time, press the red stop button above the screen. Breathe easy. Uh. Clear your mind. Just keep breathing normally. Nice and relaxed. Excellent.
And we're done. Here are your results. Look at that, 117. That was the highest price I've seen. But that's still normal. 117, 173, 92. All normal still. Very bad. Let's check your weight and body mass index. Sit in the middle of the seat. Place both feet on the bar below. Press begin to get started. Great job! Here's your Higgy score! Want to track your Higgy score and stats? Click Save Results below.